Hello Internet. Uh, in this uh, Adobe Experience uh, Manager series, I'm going to teach you how to use Experience Fragments. Now, Experience Fragments is basically reusing design or reusing aesthetically uh, portions of a page in, in, in a way that you author once and you are able to use in several or every page. Uh, that you desire to so experience fragments basically is a way of reusing um, uh, Design or design aspects in a in a, a website and that comes in very handy if you're trying to author a hundred pages uh, with the same type of uh, uh, design on the sidebar or the footer or um, um, uh, The header or the hero or somewhere else. So let's log in into a AM um, instance here and, and once you log in there you should be able to see on the global nav um, uh, experience fragments at least if it's set up that way uh, uh, by your AM impl implementation so um, you, you're trying to create an experience fragment here to use in sites so everything is being published in sites everything is being uh, assembled in sites but you go into experience fragments and you should have several folders uh, assuming you're trying to do that in this folder, uh, you just highlight an experience fragment is just like a page. It's basically a page that renders in another page. So uh, using a special comp component, of course. So you go ahead and create there and you have to be able to choose uh, uh, experience fragment. Of course, this is a folder. So this is just like a node, a parent node for all. Uh, you know certain type of experience fragments you're trying to create you have to choose a template again it's like a page so it must have a template and um, you can uh, give it a name there like that is a test experience fragment um, and you're trying to just write or author experience once and use the experience everywhere or share the experience everywhere uh, you know speaking in Adobe language so you have a passes here paragraph system you can add your components there so we can go on and say we want to add a page an image directly so let's say uh, let's add uh, let's add uh, running shoes here and let's add uh, this looked like biking shoes to me <clears throat> so we can go ahead and uh, put a text component in there and say if you like to run you know and we can say that's a h2 and that's mostly of And we can copy that and paste that, paste that, copy, paste. We can drag. Now, this is no typical use of an experience fragment because we try to use it to, to build the edges there, but for the sake of this example let's just so we have something there and we can look at it and see if we preview it, it looks good to us maybe maybe it doesn't doesn't matter now so uh, we can go back to our AM and find the page where we're trying to use this experience fragment so we go to sites go to retail we can go to US, Canada, we can go to men, we can go to this test page, we can pull it up. Um, and once we pull it up, we can decide, hey, we're trying to use this experience fragment. Now, this is just a component here, an experience fragment component. So I can delete it and re-add it so that you can see just a simple process of um, right there, experience fragment drag and drop it there uh, 
that we can configure it and there we can call it and we should always remember if we have a lot of these folders here then we might have a challenge finding this one but if we don't then we should always go back to that open it and copy the URL from content here all the way uh, without the HTML and just paste it in here and that should be able to render correctly so once we select it like that it should be able to render and we can do this for a thousand pages you know so if we try to use the same in a thousand places we can do that and once we want to update we can update only this section we can update this experience fragment and it's gonna render in every one of those uh, uh, pages that we used it for so that makes it so much easier to update once and update everywhere or at least author once and author everywhere so I hope that helped uh, if you like our content just uh, you can subscribe or you can share you can ask questions in the comments below and uh, hey if you want us to present this information in a different way um, you can just go ahead and put your suggestions there or we'll try our best uh, to give you what you want thanks